Connie, thank you. And news of Espinoza's uh, arrest has brought some relief to his loved ones. Yeah, and a lot of other people as well. This case really gripping the heart of Fresno. Many have rallied behind Nick from the start, from hosting services for loved ones to making huge donations to help get information in the case. Or Dennis Valera live at Nick's memorial in Old Fig Garden. And Dennis, you spoke with one of his old coaches. I did, Evan. She's happy about the announcement like many. However, it's a little bittersweet because she knows more arrests need to be made. When Lisa Smithcamp took the podium at the announcement of Joseph Espinosa's arrest, she took note of all the love Nick had in his life. Nicholas Calls was not just the son of Lisa Calls. He was not just the son of San Joaquin Memorial. He was not just the son of people in Old Fig who loved him. He is the son of everyone in this community. He is the son of Fresno. She also took time to speak on behalf of Nick's mother, Lisa. Smithcamp says Lisa and Nick had a great relationship and his death has left her unbelievably shaken. She understands the time, the energy, um, and the resources that have gone into this moment and to this day, and she is doing her best to uh, try to find her new normal and, and, and to push through the process. Over the phone, I talked to several of Nick's friends, all saying they just want justice to be served in this crime. Valerie Lopes, Nick's coach when he ran for the Valley Vipers Club, says she felt joy when she heard the news. But knowing there are others out there, she has a message for them to turn themselves in because that's the least they can do for taking the life of a child who had such a future and minding his own business. Now, Sheriff Mims did say that they had been getting promising leads from Crime Stopper Tips. However, they could always use more information. Remember, that reward is now $18,000. Just call 498-STOP and you can leave an anonymous tip. Live here in Old Fig Garden, Dennis Valera, KC24 Local News That Matters. Yeah, two suspects who were with the shooter still at large, Dennis. Thank you very much. There is a rosary service planned for Nick on Monday at 6 p.m. His service planned for Tuesday, his service, I should say, a separate service is planned for Tuesday at 10 a.m. Both will be at St. Anthony's Church at Maroa and Bullard. Stay with